On this Valentine's Day, Indianapolis Mayor Greg Ballard renewed the wedding vows of couples, gay and straight, at a ceremony at the city market. This comes one day after the state legislature ensured that voters would not vote this year on a proposal to ban same-sex marriage. Derek Thomas reports. Be my partner. And I will be yours. And I will be yours. Those words were extra special for Christian Mossberg, who is married to City County Councilman Zach Adamson. The pair was legally married in Washington, D.C. last October. They know that their marriage is not recognized in Indiana, but the future now has promise. The hope is always that you can, you can have everything where your home base is. You don't want to have to chase it elsewhere, and we don't want to have to leave the state to get what we deserve. The Senate vote yesterday guaranteed that voters won't be able to decide a proposed ban on gay marriage for at least two years. It's a divisive, unnecessary uh, move to enshrine discrimination into our Constitution, and uh, I think it's it's, uh, it's it's its final moment, so we're all obviously very happy about that. Well, I always said I'm not sure what the government interest is, so I mean, I so I that, and that's what I that's what I truly believe. So I was happy with the way that took that uh, went down yesterday. I look forward to a great joy. The mayor's support did not go unrecognized by Frank Dennis and his partner Darren Chittick. Someone in government is, is saying, yes, your your love is equal to everyone else's. You're an adult, intelligent citizen of this nation, and you should have the same rights as all the other adult, intelligent, you know, uh, citizens of the nation. The ceremony was sealed with kisses. All around. <laughs> this was the second annual Sharing the Love Vow Renewal Ceremony. One couple told me they enjoyed it so much they'll be back again next year. Derek Thomas, RTV6. Both sides of the same sex marriage issues are vowing strong fights in 2015 and 2016. They